consensus provides solutions that enable data architects and IT leaders to overcome intractable challenges related to large-scale data integration. And with me is Eric Daimler, the CEO of Connexus, to talk about what kind of solutions uh, you're offering for this, because I, I think about all the data that there is and will be, um, it's just mind-boggling. So what, I guess, go give me an overall view. What sure. kind of problem is Connexus trying to solve? Sure, so I, I've been spending my career in around AI of different different forms, from a researcher to a venture capitalist to an entrepreneur in, in, in Washington, D.C., in policy. And what I find is people are running up this roadblock of complexity, be, uh, even though they've gotten the memo about collecting data. You know, yeah, data is right. in oil and all that. We know so Everybody that. gets that yeah. data is expanding exponentially or mm -hmm. quadratically. Mm -hmm. What is less known is that the number of data sources is also experienced quadratic growth. Okay. Call it IoT. Okay. The the problem then is the connection between the data and the data sources in data relationships. And that's where knowledge is held. That's where all information is encapsulated. Uh -huh. But the data relationships are growing just at an unfathomably large rate. Hmm. It, that's what's breaking existing tools. And that's what Connexus uh, provides. Okay. We have a discovery in math that we've put into software that solves this problem for generally large enterprises. Okay. Well, you know, I, I love the math thing, trying to get my kids to learn about this. So right. tell me, like, how does that work? Is that a proprietary thing I'm, I'm sure that you have that connects all that? So the discovery was in math in 2011 by uh, is Professor David Spivak, who's one of our co-founders at MIT, uh, and his discovery in MIT's math department in this domain of math called categorical algebra or category theory. Categorical algebra powered this discovery uh, upon which our software is built. Okay. And then our software is just applied to databases. So I can give you an example about how this is applied. Uh, uh, it's very uh, uh, wealthy company, Uber, uh, yeah, has, a, I've heard has an a, a effectively infinite balance sheet to fund a ideal IT infrastructure. They have some very smart people by reputation, and, and that's also our experience. They wanted to uh, grow their company, however, as fast as they can. They didn't want to optimize their IT infrastructure. How they then grew was city by city or jurisdiction by jurisdiction. That then led to some problems, because if they want to analyze supply demand, just some basic business questions, sure. or they want to respect the privacy lattice of driver's licenses and license plates, depending on what country they operate in, that actually became a problem, because they ended up having 300,000 databases. Okay. And this is... These were in all the cities they were in. Yeah, all okay. the cities, all the states, all the counties. That, and so they, had to, they would do an analysis for New York City, separate from Newark, separate from Greenwich, right? Separate from Long Island. They want to combine those and not just do a statistical comparison okay. uh, for some basic business questions. Uh -huh. Driver supply, for, for example. They looked about how to solve that problem. How do we integrate that data? How do we bring our data sources and, our, and our, the data, the uh, absolute number increasing, how do we bring those relationships together for our data scientists? Mm -hmm. And they could not solve a problem with current solutions. The current solutions are 30 years old. They generally are augmented by massive amounts of manual effort. Mm -hmm. They discovered that the solution was then in math. They discovered that this domain of categorical algebra was the place they needed to look for the solution. They then looked around the world, where is this uh, uh, being respect, represented in a product, uh, and they found Connexus. Okay. We happen to be 40 miles north of them, which is convenient, yeah. but we worked with them over a period of months to come up with a solution to bring all those data relationships in a way that is allow, allows their business units mm. to make better business decisions. And to have them tell it, you know, they save over 10 million a year wow. uh, okay. by, by the, with the new alacrity with which they have those data relationships available. So you basically, the company has data, all this data, but they can't analyze it because they can't like aggregate it. I guess you help them do all that. That's what Connexus does. Yeah, the, okay. d d uh, dark data is a term that Gartner mm. came up with. It's okay. data that, that people have gotten the memo of collecting. It's somewhere in the organization, Got it. but it is too expensive, cumbersome to bring to available to the data scientists. One of our customers says they want the data available at the rate of their intuition. Mm. 
okay. So just like, you know, at a moment's notice. And there's a ton of, I mean, I was writing down, it's a trillion dollar issue. Mm. Uh, 90% of all data and data sources have been created in the last two years. And I mean, you mentioned IoT. We haven't even really got into that. And that's going to be huge data collection. The amount of data that's, that's being collected is really unfathomable. But it's in the data relationships that's even a bigger deal. Mm. You know, Delta and Airlines knows, you know, my height, my, my, my eye color, you know, whatever, my age. Mm. Uh, they know I fly for, to, to JFK, but the data models that are, are really what their business is based upon. How are they determining whether or not I'm worth uh, a particular a profile uh, as a customer? Okay. Those data relationships then become even more important when you're in mission critical or high consequence environments. You're building a jet aircraft. You're do doing an oil well. You are you're developing anything in our physical infrastructure, but really any place where tens of millions, hundreds of millions of dollars in some cases, or certainly lives are at stake. That's what our that's what Connexus's customers uh, are, are working to address with, with Connexus's product. Very interesting world that we're in and entering. So thank you so much, Eric, for coming in. Thank you. Uh -huh.